Um, in this context, I'm a little bit curious that how short selling constraint can affect the link between state-based approach and mean variance frontier. Ah, approach. yes. So <laughs> short selling and other transactions costs. One of the central assumptions I made going into this was there are no transactions costs. So arbitrary short selling is allowed. Uh, you can hold negative amounts of any security. Uh, no costs for doing so, no bid-ask spreads, and so forth. Uh, now, what happens if we change that assumption? Everything gets more complicated. We don't just throw the theory out, and this is the general point that I want to emphasize. When we add uh, rea realistic things like this, the basic ideas of these theories maintain, but you have to add all sorts of asterisks and corrections. So let's think what happens in the basic mean variance frontier. Uh, if you have a mean variance frontier and there's two assets, the, uh, the e, e and sigma, the portfolio of the two assets, that generates this frontier between them. That has positive weight on the two assets. Yes. In order to generate this part here, we have to go short this asset and long this asset, and that gets us up here. Yes. So that part of this mean variance frontier disappears when you have short selling constraints. Right. Now, let's think about that in state space. When I first introduced our state space, I said one of our assumptions is you can form arbitrary portfolios. Yes. What's going to happen when you have short selling constraints? Well, then let's suppose we, we, uh, our state space is generated by that asset and that asset. Right. right. Well, then I generated, we can buy any payoff that's a linear combination of those. Right. If we add short sales constraints, then I can only buy uh, portfolios that are here, because <laughs> uh -huh. those have positive amounts of both assets in their weights. So now, rather than an infinite plane, we're limited to a triangle, and we have to keep track of where the triangles end, and so on and so forth. Okay. It's going to make your head explode if you try to do that today. <laughs> okay.